Hi everybody, welcome to my terrain tutorial, my name is Jan Wiegaard and this is part 2 called terrain, terrain Editing Mode. So first thing you're gonna do is press Shift 3 or click on this black mountain to open the Terrain Editing Mode window. So after you've done that, you press on to call wireframe on off. You can see some blue lines turn on the screen. The smaller, the, the more blue lines they show up, the more detailed you can raise the terrain, of course, because these are the points you can raise. So to increase that, we go to Tessellation, Increase, press Yes, press again Yes, as you can see we can make more detailed terrain. So now the tools. First tool to make mountains or decrease height, to make lakes, crates, etc. We select the paint tool. After that, you can to make a mountain, for example, you hold and press Ctrl. After that, to raise the terrain, you press left mouse. To de-raise it, press right mouse. We're gonna raise it. This is simple. The next tool is called Smooth Tool. It's under the Paint Tool. Select it. As the name is saying, it's a smooth tool, so you can make the terrain a lot smoother. So we're gonna do that a bit, make the points a little bit lower. Okay. The next tool we're gonna talk about is called noise. Also, the no tool is changing height and the height and different angles. It creates a noisy, noisy terrain, almost like maybe radio waves. Another tool we have is flatten tool. What this tool does is really obvious, of course. It flats the terrain. Just control left mouse and drag. We also have the average tool. It's to create rails. Control, drag it to the location you like. Whoop. So, whoop. so we get a nice ramp, walk able ramp. We can walk on this and come on top of the mountain. This is my uh, terrain editing mode tutorial. I hope you learned something from it and you enjoyed it. Greetings.